Research shows that a quarter of people regularly overspend on their weekly shop. But is this nature or nurture? I tend to find things that I like or that the kids need and I have to go and get it. I suppose what I've probably tried to instill in them is that they should be respectful of money. I wanted to test this theory. So we've invited two families along to take part in a little experiment. The children are being given identical shopping lists and £20 to spend. Let's see if they manage to budget whilst tackling the weekly shop. This way! Uh -huh. Orange Dad. squash. Orange squash. Yeah. Yeah. See, they're not even looking at the prices. Just the first bottle they saw right in the trolley. Yep, yeah. so do you want to get some beans? Oh, Ooh. they're five for three pounds, so do you want to get five? It's amazing how that special offer works. Five for three pounds, therefore I have to get five. Driving them way over budget. Yes, we know what we're getting, don't we? Yes! I think it's in the frozen. We enough. should get this! No, we shouldn't. So it's interesting how much pleasure Rupert seems to be getting from adding things up. And there's a lot of research into that, so saving becomes quite a rewarding act in itself. £15.98 we've got left. So the way Rupert's spending tells me he's going to be a natural saver when he's older, I think. We don't! Now we can get something we would like. Yeah! And now we can spend it on ourselves, says Rupert. Yes, let's get it! OK. Did you get everything on the list? Yeah. Yeah? But yeah. like how much do you think you spent on those? About, about 17. Right, let's see who is closer. No. <laughs> OK. The lady will tell you how much it is, OK? Do you know how much you actually spent? No. You spent £20. 26 p Come on, then. Pounds, You're going to give pay the lady some money. If you've got £20 and you go over, we don't have anything to put in the pool. £19. Well you can put that pound in the piggy bank. Well done. Our experiment revealed that budgeting is a learned skill, and those who receive good advice at an early age usually take good habits into adulthood. The fact that it's a learned skill means, though, that even for those who don't have a natural ability, it's never too late to start.